Hello and welcome to Ace Chat. On today's video, I am not going to be sitting here and talking about a topic exactly. <laughs> Rather, I wanted today's video to serve as kind of like an open call promo request sort of thing. Going forward, I want to start incorporating reviews of Ace and Arrow Media into Ace Chat. This is going to incorporate a little of everything from film to TV shows, books, comics, video games. I want us to find all the Ace and Arrow rep there is out there and I want us to chat about it. See, if I sit here and just talk to myself, it's gonna be kind of stale. <laughs> and I, I, I'm one person, so I can only offer so much perspective. And for that reason, I want to have people with a diverse range of experiences, with a diverse range of opinions come in so that they can chat with me about their opinion, I'll give my opinion, we'll try to offer some context, and kind of come to this consensus of we do recommend, we don't recommend, we recommend but it could be better in this way, maybe one of us recommends the other doesn't, and so on. So to start, I wanted to go with a few TV shows. And if you feel like you are someone who could speak to one or more of these TV shows, who can speak to one of these characters, I'd love if you could reach out to acechathats at gmail.com or comment down below because I want to start reaching out to people about this. I want us to start filming this. Some caveats, for the time being at least, you have to be at least 18 years or older or have express parental consent. I'm also going to try and have different people for each video just, just so we get a lot of voices out there. So. If you feel like you can speak to more than one of these, please list them in order of which one you prefer most, and so on and so forth. Anyway, on to the shows we're going to start with. This first one comes as no surprise, he is back there in the corner. We are going to be discussing Bojack Horseman, specifically in terms of Todd Chavez, though there are obviously other ace characters on the show and we'll be talking about them too. I know I'm gonna get a lot of messages about this one, so if you want to come on and talk about Bojack Horseman, please just give me a little bit of info on why you think you'd be a good voice for this, why your experience is maybe similar to Todd's, why you are the Bojack Horseman scholar, <laughs> anything that you think is relevant. So second one that we're going to take a look at is Everything's Gonna Be Okay. This show is newer. This show has overt ace rep, just like with Bojack Horseman. I would especially like to speak with a fellow asexual who does ID as autistic, who does ID as someone with anxiety, someone who can relate to and speak to whether the ace representation was done well when those other labels identities are considered alongside of it. I've heard a lot of just varied opinions concerning that. So you don't need to love the rep. You don't need to hate the rep. I just want to know what you think about the rep. Third one we're going to be talking about is Steven Universe in terms of Peridot. Oh, that was a cat. Peridot has been confirmed Arrow Ace by several people involved in the show. I don't remember exactly who. So, you know, she's a space alien gem person. I don't really know who would be the expert <laughs> to uh, speak to that. If you go around calling people clods a lot, I mean, maybe it's you. Maybe if your birthstone is Peridot, mine is, I'm not sure. Just Maybe just if you love the show, please reach out about that. Fourth one we're gonna be talking about is Game of Thrones. Specifically, I want us to talk a little about Lord Varys, and I want us to also talk about how sexualized the show is while having this ace, uh, I think possibly, era, we'll, we'll, we'll talk about that, uh, character. Also, I want to just say for the record, some of these characters have been overtly stated as Ace, like the character themselves have said it. Some have been overtly stated as Arrow, maybe the showrunners have said it. Some of them, it's through the dialogue and just the general consensus. So we're getting into a little maybe gray area, but like, we're Aces, we love gray, right? We love black, gray, white, purple. And the fifth one, the last one to round out this, this collection of TV shows, SpongeBob SquarePants. You need one, maybe, but in interviews, the creator has confirmed that SpongeBob is ace, <laughs> and there's some debate about where he stands in the LGBTQA community. There's just there's something to talk about. So if you want to discuss SpongeBob SquarePants with me, please reach out again to acechathats at gmail.com. 
In future videos for Ace Chat, I also want to focus on other shows like Run On, Shadowhunters, I just need to finish those. Also definitely want to do Sex Education and Has Been Hotel. There's just not, not, well, okay. Sex Education has one episode that addresses this, so I kind of want to give it more time to see if it addresses it more, uh, asexuality and romanticism. Has Been Hotel has literally one episode and it's not discussed openly. There's like that one scene, but that, anyway. I just want some of these uh, shows to maybe have a little more time so that we have more to talk about, but they are, they are future, future plans. And like I said, we will also be discussing some literature with Ace and Arrow representation, such as Let's Talk About Love and Loveless and some lesser known titles as well. If you would like some recommendations for books, by the way, check out the link below. I have done several book recommendations of books by Ace and or Arrow writers with Ace and or Arrow characters for Anomaly. They're a great publication. So yeah, take a look down below and just, you know, maybe start reading because when I, when I have that call, maybe you want to come and chat with me about it. <laughs> also, like I said, be doing video games like Outer Worlds. I'm sure there's more. That's just the only one that comes to mind right now. <laughs> So yeah, if you guys have any suggestions for ones that you want to see discussed, please comment down below. So yeah, this has been Ace Chat and the chat part is kind of, kind of really coming out now. <laughs> We've already had some chats where I've interviewed people about their experiences being Ace and or Arrow and yeah, I want us to just do that, do that with the uh, media and all these other forms of rep. If you would like to be part of the chat, please email Let's Show It a Third Sign, acechathats at gmail.com. Make sure to follow us on Insta. Make sure to follow us on Twitter. I gotta do something with the Tumblr. If you want to help us with our Tumblr, also reach out. But yeah, this has been Ace Chat. Thanks for chatting with us. Can't wait to chat some more about representation. <laughs>